A federal lawsuit claims there has been a lack of action to protect homeless people from coronavirus. CBS NLA's Hermela Aragawi joins us now with more on this. Hermela. Yeah, Jasmine Suzanne Mayor Eric Garcetti is among top city and county officials expected to attend an emergency hearing today to discuss the issue. The lawsuit was filed last week by the LA Alliance for Human Rights. Last night, Garcetti announced several emergency measures to provide temporary shelters for the homeless, making 6,000 beds available. And Governor Gavin Newsom says the state will spend $150 million to protect homeless as well. Cities will get money for medical care and to rent temporary shelter in motels. And in addition, the state bought 1,300 trailers to quarantine infected homeless. L.A. County is building a coronavirus trailer park right now at Dockweiler Beach. Garcetti warns if the virus takes off in homeless camps, there will be grave consequences. As we ask people to remain safe at home, we know that too many Angelinos don't even have that option. They have no home to go to. If we do not act now, this pandemic could see our homeless population disproportionately affected, and they already disproportionately have the underlying health conditions that make them the most susceptible to morbidity. In simple terms, they are the ones who disproportionately could die as a result of this crisis. The lawsuit cites that there are nearly 59,000 homeless people in L.A. County. Jasmine, Suzanne, we've seen this number continue to grow, so it's good that they're addressing this now. Yeah, and of course, uh, you know, if they are more susceptible and they get sick, then we're going to run out of even more hospital space mm -hmm. and room to treat.